Hello, hello, my beautiful people. Thanks so much for stopping by my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Goretti and I am the counselor at Butterfly Project. So today this is going to be a really short video. I just wanted to share a really wonderful technique. Um, it's super simple, it is quick, and it is very effective uh, to be able to regulate your sympathetic nervous system. So if you are dealing with any kind of like anxiety, fears, um, especially when it is in regards to kind of like your body taking over, right? So we're talking about, you know, um, especially when we have, you know, things like, you know, maybe past traumas, PTSD, uh, things like that, any kind of anxiety, basically any fear, if you have this sud sudden fear, um, you know, right before having to, you know, let's say give a speech or have an important, you know, conversation or, um, you know, applying for that job or <laughs> waiting to hear from the job or uh, whatever it is. I mean, this is, you know, I, the list goes on and on and on. Or it could be like actual, you know, real, you know, fears based on, like I said, past traumas, you know, past things. And fear is really real, you guys. I mean, although the actual things we're afraid of typically isn't really real, right? Because it's just, you know, as you guys know, false evidence appearing real. Um, it is based on past things. It's just your ego getting in the way to try to protect you, okay? So um, if you find yourself, you know, in uh, a situation where sometimes even that anxiety comes up or that fear comes up and it's all in the body. Your body reacts first before you can even think about it. And sometimes it's just your body reacting, especially when you're dealing with like PTSD or CPTSD. It really is just your body reacting. And sometimes with anxiety, it's really just in your body. Like sometimes, you know, if shifting your thoughts isn't really working, this technique can work really great okay so it is called the cold um cold water face plunge okay so essentially it is just that it is literally you plunging you know your face into cold water or splashing cold water on your face this is also why a lot of people you know um that are um, you know, really into kind of, you know, prosperity and, um, being productive and successful and things like that. They talk about like the cold water plunge, right? So a lot of people, you know, taking that cold shower in the morning, it literally shocks your nervous system and it like, it's like a reset, a reboot. Okay. Um, it is also to get you to like, you know, when people do that for, you know, success and prosperity and, and, um, you know, uh, productivity and things like that, what they're doing is they're trying to shock their nervous system, especially in the morning to be able to, um, you know, have their senses, you know, a lot more heightened, being more aware, being more awake, especially in the morning. So when you're doing, you can do this also for that. It doesn't just have to be about anxiety about fear things like that um but it, if it is especially with your body being taken over by this like body physical reaction of fear that you can't really control with your thoughts because sometimes you can't there are times where you can't this is where this technique is really really great and so you can just splash cold water on your face um you can take a cold shower you can you know put your head into you know a, a bowl of cold water or whatever um, so you can do this, you know, basically anywhere, just as long as you have access to water and this will shock your sympathetic nervous system. Like it re readjusts it, it regulates it. It's like the restart, the reboot. Okay. It wakes up all your senses. Basically when it's about anxiety and fear, it like snaps you out of that. Okay. So sometimes, like I said, when it's just in your body and your brain has nothing to do with it, like you can't, it's not your conscious awareness, your body is feeling this. You need that, that thing that shocks your, um, you, your nervous system, right? That just like re will regulate it. It's kind of like the defibrillator with like the heart, you know, if your heart stopped and you use this machine to like shock, it's the same kind of principle, um, not quite the same, but it's, you know, similar. And so what you want to do is we want to regulate the sympathetic nervous system. We want to shock your system. Okay. Just like reboot. All right. Um, and this is the way to do it. Okay. 
So this is a really simple technique, super easy to do. I probably talked a lot more in this video than I needed to, but I just really wanted to let you guys know that this really, really does work. And sometimes you guys, it's not about your thoughts. I know I talk lots about thoughts and like reprogramming and all of that, but sometimes it's not. Sometimes your body takes over and you need something to just snap you out of it, to shock your system out of it, that it brings your awareness, um, you know, brings you back into awareness and like, you know, be really awake um, and like I said, it like, you know, regulates your sympathetic nervous system. Okay. It's like that reboot. Okay. Uh, gets you out of that loop, that pattern that you are in, in regards to that fear. All right, my loves, I hope that this was helpful for you. Don't forget to do all the things like this video, comment down below. Love hearing from you guys. Um, and also share this video with anybody that you think it could be helpful for. Um, and if you're new here, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And I would absolutely love to have you here as part of this ever growing a butterfly community. And also don't forget to hit the bell icon so you get notified of new videos when I post them, because sometimes uh, YouTube doesn't really do that. So um, and as well, if you would like to work with me, uh, whether it's in regards to counseling or coaching, I always have my information in the description box below. All right, my loves, thanks so much for being here. And as always, I wish you all peace, love and light until next time. Bye-bye.